What's up guys, welcome back to my channel, this is first case, Eden Fishing Ball, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Anyways guys, we've taken a look at this wonderful or very very great VPN here called Thund Thunder VPN. I want you guys to watch a full tutorial so you don't miss anything at all. Stay tuned. This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. This is pretty much the Thunder VPN. We just take a quick look and pretty much for the application. Well, look, I'm going to open it. As you can see here, so let's go ahead and open it. So this is pretty much the home screen of the application. Nothing hard for you to understand. Very, very straightforward application, VPN application. So at the top here, you get this option where is the globe, globe icon. This is pretty much where you go to select your servers. As you can see here, you have quite a lot of servers available, mostly United States servers. And over here, you have the streaming server, which is for streaming the website specifically. As you can see here, Netflix, Prime, Video, and so forth. So I'm just go back. And at the corner here, you have the corner icon, which is pretty much the subscription. Here you have a monthly subscription, here the subscription and weekly subscription. So those are all subscription available. They do offer a free trial over for. So let me just go back real quick. And over here you have the account section and the settings option. Here you have the auto connect when the app starts pretty much. The last server you have connected to it will automatically reconnect to. And here you can add this option as well. So it works better, which is pretty much the see the last server selected. And also the improved connection stability, but it will take longer to connect once you enable that feature. So do keep in mind when enabling that feature. Also you have the keep connected feature here as well. You can enable that and also the remove ads, but you will pretty much need a subscription to use those feature. So let's go in the server section again. Here I'm going to select a free server. So the free servers, I only have four free servers to use. And the rest you can see are pretty much the cone icon. That means you will need a subscription to use those servers. So I'm going to top on one of the fastest servers. So the green icon means the server is very good. The orange looking icon here means the server is Bad, but not that bad. It depends on how high the bar is, it will tell you the server status. Here I'm going to select the auth select option, which pretty much lets me connect to the best server, which I do recommend you guys to select as well. But if you want a specific server, then you have to select the server that you want. As I can see here, it connects in no time. And it can also give you my feedback on the app store if you like your application. And as you can see, I'm connected in no time. It's very, very fast, guys. So let's test it out and let me know in the comment section. And if you have any problem with the application or subscription at all, you can always go in the help or the feedback section to let them know that you're having a problem with your subscription or the speed of all the cases. But that's pretty much it for this VPN application. If you found this anything at all, Please comment below and with all the guys, make sure to subscribe much more. You know, if you should well, I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.